What's up guys, it's Rocky here. Welcome back to Gaming with Kids. Today we have Looney Tunes World of Mayhem. This channel is designed to be able to produce some content that my kids can enjoy as well as content that uh, if it by chance we end up getting the requirement of a thousand subscribers and over 4,000 watch hours will fund everything that they want in their lives for their future. So I'll be uh, putting it into their savings for their uh, college funds, for their car, for their house, whatever it is. I want them to be set up real good in life. That's what this channel is for. So today we have the Lucky Saloon and see what we can get as I'm going to try to uh, produce more content in the Looney Tunes game now that I actually have this studio build. If you guys want to check that out, check out the vlog channel which is linked down in the description box below on the build. I think it's, it, I don't know if it's up yet, but it will be up in the next few weeks because I'm actually behind on that. I just wanted to, to mention to you guys, but that's what this channel is all about. And I tried a little bit of it. This is a, this is a big gamble on this game. Um, our goal on the channel as well is to get to 100 subscribers before summer and uh, 1,000 subscribers before the end of the year. I think those are pretty achievable goals. If you guys would like to help support that, make sure you guys subscribe to this channel. So. There is a total of 40 stages, okay? This is the, the rules. This is the first time I've been introduced to this. I don't know if this is the first time it's been in game, but this is the first time I've been, been introduced to it. There is a thing called Super Jackpot Stage, which is 100% uh, guaranteed to get something. You're either going to get a golden ticket, a rare epic, or legendary tune piece, and a cosmic uh, stones if you're level 38 or above. I am level 37, so I won't be getting that just yet. And then jackpot stage, 100% one of the golden tickets, gems, rare and epic tune pieces, materials for tune up on your tune, and cosmic stones above level 38. And the normal stage is 75% one of the gems, rare and epic tune pieces, gold energy and XP potions, materials for tune up and your uh, tunes, cosmic stones, if I'm a level 38 or above. The problem is, is one of those is this man right here. So we can't get it but we're gonna hop in today you do get a chance to kind of cycle through it every day for free but once you do your free one it is uh, possible to uh, get a bad card so there's always that chance we'll, we'll see what happens but you have 40 chances sometimes they'll have it sometimes they won't have it but there is one in there that could be a bummer and right there was one of them. So that was bad luck, not one we wanted. We're gonna actually go ahead and continue. I've been saving my gems up for this reason to have something fun and different that's not a pack opening, which I'm going to be getting into a bunch of pack opening and character showcases on this channel. And the cool thing about that is we have a better opportunity there. So what we did with this, we definitely wanna to try to get the gems to replenish what we get. Once we get to five, we get a good little uh, jackpot. So let's go ahead and stop right there on that one again. Do we have one? Ooh, I was so glad I didn't pick that one. Let's go ahead and pick the one that it was just at. We get 10 gems. And we got the jackpot. So we're guaranteed to get something good. Give me the best of luck right now, guys. I hope I can pull something good. Uh, we definitely want to get some character shards as I'm trying to build my collection. Uh, and I don't want to use too many of the gems or my mega uh, atomizers or any of my atom re atomizers as I don't know if they're gonna do a Space Jam event and Space Jam isn't that far away and I don't want to do too much of the that and I want to just kind of beef up the characters I currently have because there's enough content for me to cover on the characters that I have. What did I get? A hundred gems! Let's go! Let's go with a hundred gems. I don't think that, honestly. Um, one yes yes we're gonna follow I don't know this one's kind of sketchy this might be an oops this might be an oops no it wasn't I'm kind of following where it was I mean there, there's always that chance that it might be the oops because it's gonna pick up the fact that I'm following it so it might not be a good idea I have a feeling this one's gonna be actually a bad one okay no it wasn't okay jackpot we're on level 10, and this is the furthest I've ever gotten so far. This is the furthest I've ever gotten. Have you guys made it all to the way to the end? Let me know in the comment section below. I actually really, really want to know. 
if any of you guys have made it all the way to the end, or if you have, haven't made it all the way to the end, what was the further you got, and how much gems did you spend on it, and is it worth it? Because right now, I've only got three characters, or three shards, four bugs. Nothing, any, anything crazy. So we get 50! Oh, dude! Dude, for Wild Card Wolf, we have 50, which means we do have the Wild Card Wolf unlocked today uh, if we cash out. <laughs> now, I'm going to keep going. I'm going to keep going. This is really risky. Um, even if I do spend a little bit of gems, I think the next one up, I think it goes up to 100. I think it moves up in 50 gem increments, so we'll see what happens. All right, we got five of those. And we're gonna follow the trend of going behind where it would have been. So, so far it's working for me. I'm just waiting for the mess up to happen where I follow the trend of where it would have been. Powering off. Oh, and it's powering off. <laughs> and what, if it, it, so far this technique is working, okay? So I hope we can get another 50. I'm feeling lucky with, I'm left hand, I'm gonna go for the far left side. Yes! That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Okay. Oh, man, when I get to the first ones, it's sketch. Okay, so I'm just gonna, like I said, continue to follow the trend where I followed behind where it would have been. It's seeming to be a very good strategy so far. Just follow case, showcasing or following where that last one would have been on the oops. Oh, yeah, I knew it was gonna happen. I knew it was gonna trick me at, at some point. But it's all good. We just spend another, uh, put a hundred gems in, and that kind of evens us. Uh, so actually, we're twenty gems down, which isn't bad. So that's very good. But my question is, is do the oops card actually go up from this point? Because we are halfway now, and I'm, I can take a twenty gem of what, or twenty gem knockoff. I don't know. You guys know what I'm trying to say. Down on that okay okay I thought it was gonna be another one I thought it was gonna be another one that one didn't have any <sighs> okay we got more five five more right there we're gonna try to continue to do the strategy where we follow where I last left off okay so now it's, it's gotten to the point to where it knows that I picked up on that so now we can't do that so now it's 200 gems so we can't follow where it was before this time so it was over there. Let's go right there. So it was there. Let's go there. Okay, we got 400. Now we are definitely down, down. But I will say it's worth it because we do have 105 of this man right here. So now I can't... This is, this is where I'm gonna have to cash out once I pick what, what it is, because I don't wanna risk it. I don't wanna risk it. We got a couple gold, or one gold ticket there. Um, definitely don't wanna risk it. I'm gonna go ahead and leave with the loot. We are going to leave. We're gonna take our bag here, play it smart, play it smart. Don't go over it, don't overachieve. We already got our wild card wolf here. Definitely really good addition to the collection today. Don't play your cards wrong. Play it correctly, play it safely, and that's what we're doing today. I'm already happy and satisfied with all of what I got today, and like you can't go wrong with Wild Wolf right there. We have that added to the collection. Wild Card Wolf. Starting off with two star. I dig it. With one rank up, and let's see where we can get the level to. We can get him to level 18, which is very good. Give really a good start to him, and we're gonna go ahead and go ahead, go ahead and go ahead. We're gonna go ahead and tune him up to a certain point to wherever we possibly can to the highest point we have. Because I know I just upgraded a couple characters actually. So let's see. So hit target enemy four times for a total of 104 damage with 10% critical chance. Oh my gosh, I think I just found one of my new favorite character leads that I definitely want to upgrade big time. Alright, so his passive skill is this tune has an 8% attack increase. 
we definitely gotta upgrade Wildcard Wolf. This is a great character card right here. Do 81 damage to the target enemy, removing a buff and removes buff. You gotta love that. Especially with the teams that always do buff damage. There, uh, one that I noticed uh, a team on the story that I'm currently on right now where it was doing a lot of buffs and that was really beating my uh, characters up. Whenever this tune lands a critical hit, it gains either attack up or defense up for three turns. The defense up is more of the style I want to do. I definitely want a defense team, but they can put out the damage, if that makes sense. Now we've got Winning Hand 2, which means hit target enemies four times for a total of 109 damage with a 10% critical chance for each buff on this tune. So if we can get a, a team of buffs with this, oh, this man will do some damage some serious work uh let's see if we can find anything nope no more attempts today on that and uh that's it we'll end it there if you guys want to see me hop back in to the lucky saloon let me know in the comment section below we'll continue to do it and test our luck on that i think what i'll do is i'll kind of stay in the 100 to 200 range until i get my gems down and then hopefully i can grind out some more to get some free gems and hopefully I didn't make the mistake in using my gems as Space Jam. I'm hoping, I'm assuming they will do a Space Jam theme. It only makes sense. Looney Tunes, Space Jam is kind of the, the main character that they're uni using is from the Looney Tunes uh, universe. So I assume they will add it on into it. But we'll see what happens. And um, if you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure you like, subscribe, and favorite, share with a friend or two or three if you made it this far in the video. Thank you guys so much. Make sure you guys check the link in the description box below for some copyright free music as well as a uh, discount on your energy drink. I am currently partnered up with Mall Energy. If you guys would like to do that, uh, you guys can actually get your first 60 servings of Mall Energy for free. All you pay for is shipping. So make sure you guys check that link down below. And if you guys want to get 10% off, use Mall 10. Link in the description box below. Bye guys. Thank you.